finished third here today. Had a good car, man. I like it just got got loose on it. The handle just went away there towards the end. Yeah, um, car was really fast all weekend. Um, you know, we did what we could once the race started. Tried to save some tires, and I don't know if Spencer missed a shift or uh, what happened there, but tore up the nose of the car, and you know, it was still my fourth late model race ever. So. Um, getting used to getting over the thought of what could be wrong with the car, what could be happening. Uh, so, I mean, the car's fast overall, so we're happy with it. Good finish for us. So, you happy with your progress? You said your fourth, your fourth oh, yeah. thing there. Oh, yeah. Jerry Fryer finished second here, man. You had to start eighth, though. Did you burn your stuff up just trying to get up the front? Not, uh, I just got tight there at the end. I mean, we started off trying to go get up there with some of the faster guys and stay in the clean area, but, uh, I oh, know it's pretty good compared to what we practiced with. It's fought loose all day yesterday, and then we worked on the bunch. Ended up being tight this afternoon, so and then qualifying. So we made some adjustments for qualifying for a race, and uh, it's a lot better. You just can't thank my dad and Mark Fryer enough for the coming day and appreciate this thing. It's awesome. Trevor Knowles here, man, got picked up to win here, had a great car. You were hating seeing him caution because I believe the longer this thing ran, the faster it got. You catch Harrison, the caution come out, he'd jump away from him. Then what happened down here going around a lap car? Yeah, we've been setting this thing up for the long runs. You know, on the cold tires, I can stay with him for a little bit. Uh, but, um, yeah, over here, turn uh, one and two, um, some lap car got in the way. And he he come to the inside and just shot the 70, or the lap car in the, uh, in the middle of the track. I had to go high, I had nowhere to go. And all I could catch it, I left my, on the corner of my eye was, you know, the Harrison got sideways and he could catch it and got sideways again. And, and I passed him on the outside and kept on digging. Yeah, you think even with the lap car, you think you, you, you eventually would have got around him there? Uh, he's tough. Um, if we could have had a long run, I, I think we could have got him. But um, it's just hard to tell. Yeah, well, tell, tell me about the people that helped you on this thing. Yeah, uh, my parents, Knowles Cabinets Incorporated, they, they, they're they the big part of this. X1R, a big uh, old company, they uh, helping us big time too. And Coulter Motorsports is just the main one. But um, yeah, I just can't thank Randy Renfro enough. Um, Joey Coulter come from the, come down from Charlotte to spot for me. But um, I, just, I just can't thank everybody enough.